miss what I had But oh, maybe for you belongs to the past In the back of your mind you might think there's something more I want But when I got what I got, girl, I to Guitar with Dev. If it's your first time visiting, go ahead and hit that subscribe button without giving it a second thought. Just kidding. But seriously, hit that subscribe button. I've got a great lesson for you guys today on the song called Got What I Got by Jason Aldean. It's a beautiful country love song with a little open, beautiful three chord chord progression with a little turnaround that just repeats itself throughout the entirety of the song. Can't wait to share this one with you guys and hear what you guys think. So if you haven't grabbed your guitar yet, go ahead and grab it, pop a capo on the second fret, and follow along. So we'll start things off with the chord progression. Our first of three chords is the A suspended two. Looks like this. Most of you probably already know this chord, but we're gonna make sure we use our third and fourth fingers. Third finger in the second fret of the D, fourth finger in the second fret of the G string. And we're going to strum the bottom five on all three of these chords. Second chord is pretty easy. We're just gonna slide this exact same shape down two frets, one, two, into that fourth fret. And we're gonna put our first finger down in the second fret of the A string. That's our B chord. So we had A, Slide it down two frets, add the first finger. It's our B chord. And then we slide this exact shape down two more frets. One, two. That's our C sharp minor. And every time you end on this C sharp minor at the end of this chord progression, you're gonna do two little turnaround hooks, which is you strum, and immediately slide down to the second fret. Sounds something like this. Back to the A. She said, baby, do you ever miss being alone? Here we go, turn around. I said, I come. Back to the A. If you are interested in learning the finger picking portion of this song, then first things first, this song's written in a 6 8 time measure, meaning we'll be counting to six each measure. And in this particular song, that's going to be um, emphasis on the one and the four. So count with me to six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's how you're gonna to wanna to emphasize it too, on the one and the four. So using that practically, we've got our A chord, and then our right hand is going to be picking with the thumb on the A string, and then first finger G, second finger B, third finger E, and then back down. Kind of rolls. picking pattern for each chord so and there's a chord change after each measure so starting off with the A let's count together slowly one two three four five six one two three four five six one two three four five six turn around up today's guitar lesson. 
thanks for dropping in. I hope you had fun. I hope you were able to follow along and learn something new. I certainly had fun teaching this lesson. If you enjoyed it, please go ahead and hit that like button and leave me a comment and let me know how I did or how I could do better in upcoming videos. Until next time, keep picking.